that has to be the teachers and the relationship that I formed with so many of them and the staff at Heritage. Um, it's been such a blessing to have people that don't just care about you academically or just for you in the ministry, but but for you as, as a child of God and they watch over your soul and they pray for you. And, and I, I know, like you, you just know that you can go to them at any time with anything at all and, and ask for prayer and they're gonna be there and they're gonna love on you and they're gonna point you to Christ. And that's just been the biggest blessing really. Everyone there was so amazing and so fun and the community and the atmosphere was just, it just was beyond what I expected. How much I, I love it and how much I love being there. The bonds that you can make with your profs and how when they say that their doors are always open that they really mean it and they mean it in the way that their doors are open for you to talk about school um, but you can also talk about life with them and that they truly care for their students at Heritage. The faculty, the students, all of it. It's a great school and I was genuinely surprised by how much I loved being there when I was never really one who cared for school. I found it really awesome that um, some of the profs would come play sports and that you can just bond with your profs in different ways and I was super intimidated by the profs going in to Heritage but they care so much and they want to support us as students and I thought that that was such an amazing part about being a student at Heritage. I would have to say um, my favorite class was theology. I was able to take it in my first year and it really taught me a lot about um, why I believe what I believe um, and I learned so much more about God. Um, we talked about eschatology, spiritual gifts, uh, the Trinity, the humanity of Christ, the atonement, um, and I learned so much about um, the why behind things and I learned so much more about God and it really helped me um, understand my faith more and understand the God that I worship and it really just taught me to think more critically about um, and understand the Bible better when I read it. My favorite class so far at Heritage has been ethics. I love that class because of just the topics that we were able to address and just there was a lot of um, issues that are happening in the world today so it was very relative and it was very um, today's day and age um, related so it helped me a lot it impacted me a lot I would leave that class really thinking about everything we talked about uh, I'd have to say if you want a class that is going to sanctify you to like a whole other level um, a class that has enriched my life in every way uh, a class that I will take with me to glory. It's that good. You gotta take Greek, man. You gotta go for Greek. This is a tough one. Carolyn Weber teaches a lot of classes that like aren't really my favorite subject, like essay writing, uh, English literature, but she is such a fantastic prof that she can make any class interesting, any class fun. She made essay writing fun. She made she made English literature fun. Whatever class she's teaching, like she could teach colors, I don't know. Whatever she's teaching, she has a way of making it fun and engaging. Playing sports and, well, preferably basketball or volleyball, but any sport, pretty much. Um. Blacking out the H and and playing hide and seek in the dark, just like in the whole building. Serving the community, like on a, on a major scale, that that is that is pretty solid. That's pretty fun. Going out for coffee and exploring Cambridge. Even just being able to um, seeing the partnership between the churches in Cambridge and with Heritage, it's been cool to be able to partner with some of them um, through evangelism and local outreach. I was actually the local outreach chair on student council last year. So being able to um, do some um, networking with those churches and being able to work together with them with different like community outreach projects has been really cool. I wish I, wish I had a clear answer to this question going into to Heritage. I'd say, you are here for the sake of the local church. I mean, what role does the church play? The church is the reason why you're here. When you're bored, there's always something to do at Heritage. You can 
go play ping pong, get a drink from the bean, go shoot hoops in the gym, read a book in the library. There's always something to do and everything is available to you. And it's just like everything's right there. It's like a little house on a hill. And I just, I love everything about that. And just the community is so wonderful. And so res life is the best. This is generally nice to, you know, live with your friends and you know, make new friends while you're there and everyone, you know, you could have fun and be dumb, <laughs> you know, and just be college students, but also you could be serious and have like some of the best life chats that you'll have, you know, with, with people your age during this stage in life. I love it so much. Like being able to be surrounded by such an amazing community of girls um, has just helped me grow my faith so much. Um, you know, when we're, you know, getting ready for a fun event, being able to do each other's makeup and hair or, you know, just um, making a meal together um, or, you know, playing games or having impact group, which is the small group we have on Monday nights. Um, it is just so amazing to be surrounded by all of my best friends. By far the most incredible thing about living on campus is the friendships that you will get to build. I mean, the friends that I've made are people that are gonna go with me to glory. Like these are eternal friendships. It's not cheap, man. It is just so rich and full of grace. And we get to build one another up and pray for each other. Don't miss out on the community. Don't um, stay in your room and miss out um, on all that you can learn um, and all that you can experience um, from Heritage. The community is unlike anything I've experienced before and the friends you make there, you will probably have for life. So uh, don't miss out on that and get um, as plugged in and involved as you possibly can. Um, and something else that I would say that has had an amazing huge impact on me is um, getting involved in local ministries. So I was able to serve as local outreach chair last year and being able to to go to my comfort zone and do door-to-door -door evangelism and go downtown and volunteer at the homeless shelter and um, things like that pushed me out of my comfort zone and really taught me about um, God's heart for um, the broken and the lost and the importance of sharing the gospel with them. And um, so I would highly recommend uh, getting involved in either the local outreach committee or the global outreach committee or honestly any of the other committees at Heritage. Um, it'll be an amazing way to serve and give back to the community and also um, make new friends and um, yeah, get plugged in the church and uh, get plugged in everywhere you can at Heritage and you will not regret it. Pray. Pray before you get to Heritage. Pour your heart out before the Lord. Make a, a list of goals that you want to achieve by God's grace. And, and by his spirit at your time at Heritage and, and come in prayerfully and have fun, like come in expecting and preparing to enjoy your time. This is probably one of the most exciting things that you're ever going to experience uh, this side of glory. And then um, lastly, I'd say, listen, it's easy to fall asleep in a campus and where we're all Christians and, and we all speak the same language and we all like the same things. Um, so once you get here, just get involved in local outreach, get involved in global outreach, get involved in serving the community and because God is working locally and globally and being able to join and, and play a part of that with other brothers and sisters your age is, is so encouraging and it's just so fun. So yeah, those three things. I'm just so excited to be back in the fall and to meet all of uh, the new students and be back with um, the amazing community and my amazing friends. Um, and I'm just so excited to see what God has in store. Um, if you come to Heritage, I guarantee you will grow like you never thought you would. And you will learn so much and uh, God will stretch you out of your comfort zone and teach you so many new things about himself and yourself. So I can't recommend the school enough. It is just so amazing.